short demonstration of Freonce Mobile showing gas distribution GIS maps on smartphones and tablets. We've got a Blackberry here showing uh, gas distribution with leak points and it's a live GIS that we can turn layers off and on for. Let's go ahead and see aerial photos and distribution and, and leaks over here on the Android. I've got another distribution uh, map up of a different area, different groups, so we can have different maps uh, for different groups. Let's go ahead and identify on uh, this point on the BlackBerry. This also works on the iPhone. We can see information right from the live GIS. We can also zoom to our GPS location we can digitize new points. Let's come into uh, the iPhone here application and uh, show you how this looks also. So we have an Android and iPhone map up and we've got some different maps here showing leaks, protection, distribution. Let's go into this distribution application. Just like the Android here, the iPhone, the application looks the same. No matter what device we're in, Blackberry, iPhone, Android, same live GIS service. These are custom applications that are built by the end user. Searches, identifies. Let's go ahead and show how we can turn on different layers here. Layer controls all managed by the organization, how they want to display layers, see them. But these applications are built for very user friendly uh, on the end on the back end uh, even the data layers come up automatically just like a desktop GIS as farther I zoom in come in here and the same identify on a feature just like we would any other way we'll go ahead and tap on it and see that information In here and identify this uh, feature and uh, edit the attributes. It's a meter. So let's go ahead and add to edit the attributes and we can see our pull downs come up. So that our end user is in our correct database rules and domains. Let's go ahead and Take a photo. And uh, we want to take a photo of that meter because we want to change the attributes. And uh, we can save those photos right to the database so that the next time we go into that photo or that feature and identify it. we'll see that that meter, that photo is right there that we took. So we can digitize new points. You can come in here and digitize a service line or a meter, whatever layers you want to digitize. Come in here, pick the point, fill out the attributes just like the iPhone. Save it. And that is a feature right in the SDE. So even on the iPhone, if I come over here and I zoom to that same area, I'll see that same feature. So let's go to that same meter location. We'll come over here on the uh, Android and see that we can turn on uh, aerial photos. So whatever data is in the GIS yeah, shows up in the phone. And there's that uh, same area. Here's the meter over here on the Android. Here's the meter over here on the iPhone that I just created on the Android. Shows today's date. Even edit those features. Once again, 
add a photo, edit attributes, so forth. So GIS live on iPhones, Androids, Blackberries, tablets, iPads, uh, all with the uh, ability to zoom to uh, locates, system locates, uh, features, end users and this is just showing a GPS uh, location of uh, where I am up on the map so we can even zoom to our GPS location and have that track us down the street so free on mobile great way to get your gas distribution maps out on smartphones and tablets in-house without programming and free on mobile will allow you to create one application and have it out on all three platforms at one time. Freons Mobile.